Hi guys, it's Gabby. So today I'm going to be filming an updated vanity tour What's in my vanity. I'm very excited for this video because I thought I would do an updated version. Um, a few months ago, I actually posted a room tour, a closet tour, and a vanity tour. So you guys can go check all of that on my channel. I'll even put links down in the description box so you guys can go see that. But this is basically an updated version. So let me just kind of give you an overview. This is my vanity my other piece and then this is my mirror and my tapestry i'm gonna go through every little detail that is what the point of this video is but i just wanted to give you guys kind of an overview um it's quarantine so i'm not wearing anything cute so sorry about my appearance but it's like fine okay so first things first is i started i actually got the idea from this video by posting a tiktok so if you guys want to check out my tiktok it'll be in the description box i kind of posted another video like a quicker version of what's in my vanity on there so you guys can go check that out along with other videos um but i was getting a lot of questions on what that where the dressers were from and like the mirror and everything so i thought that this would be a perfect video to explain all of that so first things first the tapestry as you guys can see it is hung up on my wall it's actually hung up just right there and right there with two very little um nails and yeah that's basically the only part and then in the middle as well i got this from amazon um i literally just typed in tapestry and this is the one of the ones that came up um i got this one in particular because it's actually the theme of my room which is blue um and white and gray as you guys can like um see but yeah, it actually matches my lamp perfectly. I don't know if you guys could tell. Crazy, because I got th that at Target and this on Amazon. Um, but yeah, so that's basically where my um, tapestry is from. I was getting a lot of questions on where my mirror was from. And it's actually handmade by my dad. I had this old mirror. As you guys can see, this is actually a mirror. Um, well, duh, it's a mirror. But it was actually a brown mirror. So the frame was brown. And what my dad did is he basically just... Uh, painted the frame white, did a few coats that it looked new and refreshed, and then he actually installed all of the lights individually. So he asked me how many I wanted on the top or the bottom. I just said the sides and I said five, right? One, two, three, four, five, yeah. Um, but yeah, so that's basically what it looks like. I'll actually turn it on. This is the switch so you guys can see what it looks like turned on. Um, it's very nice. It works amazing. And I love that he made that for me. So yeah, sorry guys, you can't get this anywhere. It was literally, my, my dad literally made it. Um, but yeah, so you can make it really high, make it super, super bright, which is amazing. I don't know, should I keep it like that? No. And then you can also dim it really, really low. But yeah, that's what that is. And that's also what the little cords are from. It's from that. I'm getting like out of breath. Who haven't filmed a video in a minute. All right. So yeah, so that's where the tapestry is from. That's where the mirror is from. Okay, now on to this piece right here. Now I actually had someone once again ask me where this desk was from. And once again, it's actually not a desk or a vanity. Um, it's actually three individual pieces. Now, I'm going to be completely honest. I love Ikea. I think they have an amazing stuff. All of my furniture is from there. It's very clean, very sleek, which I love. But it tends to be like on the smaller side. And so all of like the vanities that they had were kind of small. I mean, this is small as well, but it's not as bad. And I can actually make it bigger and I'll tell you guys how. So basically... These two pieces right here, none of this is connected, by the way. So you can literally just pull it out. It's literally just two um, drawers and then a slab and then a glass. So like I said, these two pieces are from Ikea. I'm sure if you type in white drawer set, you can find them. They have different types. They have one with bigger drawers, smaller drawers, like literally a bunch. I chose these. Um, they also have like mini ones. Like I said, that's how you can make it taller because you could stack up more. Um, but yeah, so that's what that is from. The slab is also from Ikea. They have smaller ones. They have longer ones. I was going to get the longer one because I wanted it to be like a longer vanity. However, obviously the size of my room, I couldn't do that. But that is an option if you guys prefer something smaller or something even bigger than this. The glass, actually, Ikea did not have any just plain glasses. The only glasses that they had had like specks on them and there was it wasn't just plain. So I actually, my dad just got someone to measure uh, my vanity and just create a glass piece for this and they kind of just... Um, not glued it but I guess they just put it down to the table but the actual table isn't connected to any of the drawers 
which is, I mean, it doesn't really do anything. It's not like it moves all the time unless I physically move it. Um, but yeah, so that's kind of the deal with those furniture pieces. I'm going to do that one at the end. Um, so you guys can see, actually, you know what? I'll do it right now. So yeah, that's where the tapestry is from. That's the mirror. That's the desk situation. And now this piece right here. Now I actually, um, during quarantine, I did some renovations and this actually was not here before. This was there and I moved it here because I couldn't get the drawers to come out. And so I thought this would be a much better place for it, especially since this is kind of like in the beauty section. I like to keep my room very, very organized. So obviously this is all vanity and beauty and then this as well. And this is my desk. Like I said, I like to keep everything like together. And then my other dresser has my jewelry. So it's like very organized. And this definitely makes a lot more sense i plan on doing something right there so hopefully that gets done but yeah this is also from ikea they have a bunch of different ones like i see like i said ikea has a lot of good things this is probably one of the bigger pieces that they have um they have this in white i'm pretty sure black like um a tan color they have a bunch and they also have different ones when i actually went to the store they have ones where it's like all of the all of the drawers are this size they have ones where all the drawers are very large they have ones where this is just flat and then they have ones like mine that opens up so like like i said there's a bunch of different ones this is the one that i picked in particular because i thought this was just like the perfect combo for this type of piece um but yeah so like i said i don't know the exact name for any of them but i'm sure if you look it up ikea doesn't ever like get rid of their stuff so you could just search it and it'll be there but yeah so that's kind of the deal with all of the um furniture pieces everything is literally from ikea or handmade um and yeah so let's just kind of go through this piece first so when you open it up right here like i said there is a mirror from ikea i love this um and over here i have all of my makeup palettes so these are kind of like for eyeshadow larger ones that i don't want to fit in like a drawer i think it's perfect because i don't necessarily wear eyeshadow that often but when i do it's here it's accessible that's why i don't keep anything on top of it because it's just a lot easier for me to um get a hold of my first drawer right here is kind of like my junk drawer and i actually cleaned all of this out so it's actually very organized um but yeah so this is kind of a junk drawer i have like mostly like electronic things or things that i have to like get rid of like for example this is perfume this is a birthday gift but i was planning on making a birthday video which is why this was here some cards and stuff that i have to like sort through which is why <laughs> this is also here but this is mainly like a junk drawer and like electronic headphones chargers you know when you go to europe and you need the thing and yeah portable chargers you know more cords stuff like that so that's kind of what that drawer is um iphone cases stuff like that my second small drawer is from actually is from <laughs> it holds my uh cheer bows so i used to be a cheerleader i used to do competitive cheer and this drawer makes me so super sad because i won't ever really be using these again so i don't know what to do with them i kind of just keep them here i have literally a bunch some were made from our coaches or the staff um and then some i bought at the competitions and yeah so i kind of love these also this was um last year's competition bow and then wait yeah yeah yeah. this was a competition bow and this was a competition bow those two um but yeah okay and also i just want to like clarify this is a mirror these two are small and then these four are larger and they're the same size so it's six drawers two small four large and then one mirror sorry i meant to clarify that before so yeah junk drawer cheer bows the first large drawer has my hair products so like I said, I cleaned everything out. This used to be a mess before, but it's much more organized. These little bins that you guys are going to be seeing are also from Ikea. Like I said, they have a bunch of stuff. They literally have bins like this. You're going to see I have a big one. They have um, squares, rectangles, like a big square. Like they have a bunch. They also have multiple different colors. I used to have this in like purple. Um, they have blue. Like, like I said, they have a lot of stuff. But yeah, these are great to organize your products in drawers, stuff like that. Um, but yeah, so this has all of like my head bands scrunchies hair ties and then over here are my like um what do you call it like my hair products like gels stuff to scrunch your hair with here i have um some hairspray my hairbrush i actually had to get a new one and i love this one because it's so freaking big i believe i got it at walmart or my mom did i don't know um but yeah so this is where i keep all of my hair products so first drawer because you know 
I don't know, it just is, <laughs> but yeah. Okay, so the second large drawer, I have, once again, these are the bins that I was talking about. This is the same one from up there, and then this is like a big square, and they fit perfect in all their like um, drawers, which is amazing. I think that's why they, what they're meant for. Um, but yeah, so this has all of my lotions and perfumes. So over here, I have my lotions, and then I have like small um, perfume, like samples, and like ones you get in like packs. This had all of my large perfumes however i literally have been using them all up because every single one had like this much in it and i'm like what the heck is the point so i started using the ones with less so that i could get rid of it and that's why it's like so empty um i also have some extra perfumes that didn't fit up there so that's kind of the deal i have to restock this but i have enough like you know i don't need to i don't need an excessive amount um but yeah this is kind of where my perfume and my lotions are the third large drawer is my toiletry so this is where i keep my toiletries and like i said once again we have the bins the squares that i was talking about so over here i have makeup wipes i have this is for your nose when you're sick cough drops i have my tanning spray um and then i have this is like a massager so yeah that's what's in there over here, I have like um, teeth stuff. So I have floss, mouthwash, toothbrushes, toothpaste, um, stuff like that. Over here are, is where I keep my razor blades, like the new ones, some Q-tips, and then my deodorant. So like I said, this is all of my toiletries. So like stuff I, you know, just right. You guys are, I don't need to explain. You guys get the point. Okay, and the last drawer I have here, once again, more of these little um, containers. I'm pretty sure you could even fit like one more. I think you can, yeah. Um, but yeah, so over here I have all of my nail stuff. So I have it color coordinated. So these are all the cool colors, the blues, purples, and then pinks and reds. And then over here I have like a bunch of elf ones, like smaller nail polishes and then these are like nail polish um like designs like you know acrylic stuff like that like nail files like the tools you need um but yeah so that's kind of the deal with this and that is basically everything that's in my ikea six drawer set i love it it keeps everything super organized and definitely since we are in quarantine it's definitely motivated me to organize everything when i tell you i have organized every single bit of my room i literally have it's crazy i feel like this happened I mean, obviously, no, nobody wanted this to happen, but in a way, it's kind of a good thing to get everyone organized if you're staying home. Like, don't go out or else bad things will happen, but you guys get the point. All right, so now on to my vanity. So this is my vanity. I'm just going to go from bottom to top and then bottom to top over here. Okay, so this has one, two, three, four, five, six drawers. This also has six drawers, so 12 in total. I think it's perfect. If I ever, like I said, wanted to add more, I can. I'm pretty sure they have one where it's like one slab, one slab, and it's like a thing and you can like put it under um or like on top it's really cool you guys got to check out ikea they have a bunch of stuff um but yeah okay so the first drawer this is where i keep my large uh travel bag so whenever i need to carry my makeup hold my toiletries stuff like that this is where the large bags are located i love this jeffree star bag but i kind of have to squish it because it's so big but i love the size i need to get more of those because they're literally so good but yeah so these are all of my large bags second one up are my smaller bags so this is more for like toothbrushes smaller products just stuff like that so this is where i keep my smaller bags i like to keep literally everything organized and together it's just like how i roll but yeah so that's that this drawer has my large travel mirror. Now this you plug in. I used to use this for competitions all the time, but you could use this for travel as well. Basically, it, you plug it in and you can adjust the settings and it's a big mirror that has a mirrors on the side, the big mirror in the front, and it's a mirror and also it gives off light. And then I have a bunch of candy and stuff for my hamster. So these mason, mason jars have like Snickers, Milky Ways, stuff like that, more snacks, and then this is for my hamster not snacks for me but they're here because you know i have a hamster it's not in my room right now i put it downstairs because it runs on the wheel makes a lot of noise but yeah so this is all stuff for my hamster the cleaning soap for my hamster the extra um you know tube thing snacks the ball which i have to clean i haven't put them in there in a long time um but yeah so that's that drawer 
Now onto the smaller ones. So this has all of my makeup. Every the top four have my makeup, or technically top three. You'll see. But um. Once again, these little things are from Ikea. Um, I got them literally at the store and I just tested it in one of the drawers to see if it would fit. And it did, so it's perfect. It has these little grips so like nothing falls, which I think is really good for makeup because I keep everything together. Um, I used to have a lot more makeup than this, but I literally just decided i was like you know what i don't need to be spending a bunch of money on makeup but i'm not even going to use all of it at once so i just got rid of a lot of stuff that maybe looked expired was older i haven't used um and yeah so that's a really good way to like keep everything organized so everything on this side is all of my foundations and concealers so i have my milani as you guys can see my shape tape and then my beauty blender so that's kind of what's on here sorry this is bothering me okay <laughs> and then over here I have my eye stuff and um, just kind of random things. I have my powder right here, my eyebrow products, a bunch of mascara, some primer, um, eye gel, not eye gel, eyebrow gel, eye, random eyeshadow thing, um, lip scrub. But yeah, that's kind of what's on here. Okay, so now the top one. Over here, I have once again the same two dividers. Um, they're also really cheap. I think they're like a few cents or like a dollar. By few cents, I mean like 80, but or maybe they are a dollar. I'm not really sure, but they're they're cheap. Um, so on this side, I have all of my lip products and chapsticks. So as you guys can see, I have like smaller lipsticks, bigger lipsticks, chapsticks, my Vaseline. And then on this side here, I have my um, powders and my um bronzers and then also um morphe setting spray so this is bronzer this is bronzer this is bronzer and then that's it's also powders because it's like two in one palettes and then my morphe setting spray but yeah that's everything that is on this side of my vanity okay now moving on to this side and once again i'm gonna go up and down Whew. all right so the bottom one right here i have a bunch of my um school stuff and notebooks so the reason why it's turned over is because um um, it's, I don't know, stuff for school. But yeah, so I have a bunch of like notebooks, folders, novels. Um, this is my stuff for biology. So this is kind of just like for sc school, for class, like extra notebooks I have in this drawer because I do my homework right here. Sorry for the garbage. Um, but yeah, so that's what's in that drawer. This drawer right here, I have more I have personal notebooks and um, Polaroid stuff. It kind of just makes sense for myself, but I have to explain it to you guys. Um, so basically right here, I have a bunch of notebooks. I love to write. I love to write YouTube ideas, random stuff. It's just always been my thing. So I have just a bunch of that. And then a bunch of stuff for my Polaroids, as you guys can see. So this is this uh, little um books that carry the polaroid pictures this prints them out i have um a disposable little film like little stuff for the polaroid itself and then my tripod so that's kind of the deal with this drawer now if we go one more up this is a self-care drawer sorry that's supposed to be there this is a self-care drawer, and once again, the same bins. These three are all from Ikea. I got these there as well, super cheap. I thought this was perfect because I wanted something that I could see what was in it, but also, like, keep it organized. So this is, like, my self-care drawer. Um, in this one back there, I have, like, random stuff for self-care. And then this one, I obviously have pads and tampons. And then over here, I have a bunch of face masks, um, like Glow for your skin, Mario Badescu. This is my Zyrtec that I have to take because I have chronic hives um like perfume this is actually for like your room but i love the smell um this was for my piercings um some you know just a bunch of stuff like that ba little bath bombs this is my men's dye for my eyebrows and then over here i have like my glasses these aren't like prescription glasses these are the blue light or whatever that like it doesn't harm your eyes as much when you're looking at a screen i actually really love these because i find that sometimes i get headaches when i stare at the screen too long especially when i work because i used to, i work for my mom um i was about to say used to because i haven't worked in a while for her but i have to go again um but yeah so i found that when i put these on i actually don't get a headache um and then over here i have like little stuff for the bath so like i said this is kind of all self-care okay now one up here once again back with the same drawers i'm gonna get up so in this drawer i have a bunch of hand sanitizer on this side and then this stuff is for the car and then eyelashes and um this is a wax melt but i actually got rid of it i want to get a new one because the other one i had was really old but yeah so i have a bunch of 
with hand sanitizer here little cut like the hand sanitizer holders the stuff for your car i haven't been driving so i haven't got a chance to refill it um this is for the wall plug-in eyelashes new eyelashes this is wax melts it you put a little it's like a uh, wax of candle and then you put it on the thing and it melts it and it makes your room smell good so that's what that is okay and then one more up sorry hair just fell this one has my um highlights and my blushes okay so on this side i have all of my larger palettes as you guys can see my glow kits i have three actually i lied i have two and then a tart one and um, then on this side i have my smaller highlight highlighters so jeffree star bobby brown uh Too faced milani this is actually a blush but i keep it here um and yeah so that's basically everything that's in all of my drawers i'm just gonna quickly go over what's on top okay so this is an overview once again. Um, so I like to keep everything kind of minimalistic. When I first got it, I had a lot more things. Not like a lot, but it, uh, just more. But I got rid of everything because I just wanted it to look clean. So starting from the left over here, this is actually a diamond and it's from Home Goods. I get a lot of my room decor from Home Goods and TJ Maxx because I just love it. Everything is a lot cheaper and it's honestly so freaking good. So yeah, it's just a silver um, diamond. I don't know if you guys could tell. At first I didn't, I couldn't tell, but now I can. So I just keep that in the corner. Um, these two, I, eyebrow, what? These two makeup brush holders are from Ikea. Once again, I like everything to be white and clean, so I got this from Ikea. Um, and this one, I have my daily, like, makeup brushes whenever I do my makeup, and then these, I don't use as much. Um, okay, so moving on to the center, this little holder is from Home Goods. Once again, the bottom is actually a mirror. I thought it was very pretty. It's white, like I wanted, and it literally just keeps all of my, um, more expensive perfumes. So the ones in the drawer is, like, you know, like the sprays, the mist, the one from Victoria's Secret, Bath and Body Works, stuff like that. And then these are like the ones that you have to like buy that cost a little bit more money. Um, I kind of just like to display those right there. And then over here, that's a little switch for the lights. And then I have another mini light. This is also from Home Goods. Um, I like to do this when I do my makeup. I kind of get it a closer view and it also flips. So you get a bigger side. I like this one because I'm ugly. Um, this is a Febreze thing. It's actually, this is the way you're supposed to use it. My mom didn't know that. I think nobody knows that. Everyone lifts it up from the top. And then I watched a video and it was like, you're using it wrong. And it wastes so much more. That's why they don't tell you to open it because they want you to use it up and buy more. If you're watching this, lift it up from the top. Okay. This drawer, this little thing is also from Ikea. I wanted this to uh, hold my bath bombs. So these are the larger ones. I used to have more, but I used them obviously. So I have those in there. They are from Lush. Okay, you guys, so that is the end of this video. I really hope that you guys enjoyed. I thought it would be a really good idea to kind of give an in-depth and updated view on what my vanity is looking like, especially since I cleared a bunch of it out, organized it, changed a lot of stuff, and also added a new piece. So yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!